a guy brought a gun basically to come save Maria, who's a 200 pound female wrestler who trains MMA and does hardcore matches. She has millions of hits on YouTube for doing all sorts of death matches and taking razor blades, self inflicting and uh, cutting herself and going through chairs and tables and uh, glass and all sorts of stuff. So her being fragile, I thought was something that was uh, definitely blown out of proportion and her doing MMA training with me and not wanting to get hit at all, I thought was ridiculous for me as a coach. If you're training Ronda Rousey or you're training Holly Holmes or something like that, uh, if you're going to actually get them ready for a fight, for them not to do any sparring or any in-ring training would be preposterously retarded. Pardon my word for Colt Cabana. I don't mean to use that word in the wrong context. But uh, I think it would be very bad training as a trainer trying to get her ready for potentially an MMA fight or uh, a boxing match, which is what happened. And then that whole thing got blown out of proportion. I got a charge supposedly for all this different stuff what happened was the next day maria went to court and she said that's not what happened we were training and the charge was immediately dropped so that's again not on my record uh, my record is a different type of thing and that's from six years ago and uh five and a half years later almost six years later i've done what i can do as a member of society that's made a mistake is pay my dues do my probation pay my fees go to my classes show up on time and pass my piss test and that's what I've done, and I've done that for the reason of wanting to get back into wrestling. Thank you for watching the Hannibal TV. Please like this video if you enjoyed it, and click the subscribe button to not miss any of our latest shoot interviews, match videos, or news updates. Follow us on Twitter at the Hannibal TV for instant updates.